Hello, Interverse. Hello, Facebook, Twitter, Reddit, YouTube, Steam It, Whale Shares, wherever you are. Hello, hello, hello. What's up, my tutorial crew? Crypto G here, coming at you with another Lightworks video tutorial. Um, this time, I'm just coming at you with some funky effects. It's actually a title effect, but um, we're not going to use it as a title effect. We're, I'm just going to show you how you can um, use it to create a nice funky little effect for your video. Okay, so I'm just going to, as you've seen, start a new project. So I'm going to just call this funky effects. Uh, or in fact, mirror effect. Let's call it that mirror effect. Uh, I'm going to make this auto the frame rate, and then off we go. It's very handy. You can, if you've got a file on the desktop, you can just simply drag it into into your project contents. Okay, so we've got that there. That's been imported. Uh, I'm going to edit. I go to my edit tab. I'm going to turn off my sound because I don't need to turn off all the soundtracks and let's just bring in the video. Okay, and then I'm going to forward to uh, about here and press C on my keyboard, right click and remove. I should have probably said delete and close gap. And then, oh, that's a nice shot, isn't it? And then we'll go to, say, yeah, there. Um, and I'm just going to peel that back to where I want it. Okay, and it's, there we go. Just there. Right, so I've got a clip that uh, I'm happy with now. Let's just have a quick look at that. And it's this guy, uh, this is a British vintage boxing advert. This guy, I can't remember his name, Charlie something. He's a lightweight boxer, I believe. Um, just doing some shadow boxing. Okay, so I'm going to go to my VFX tab. Just going to make this a little bit bigger so that we can see it. Right, so then I'm going to go over uh, and I'm going to add an effect. I'm going to come right down to the bottom to text and where are we we're going to look at 50% strap center text I'm going to choose that um, straight away I'm going to get rid of the text because I don't want that so heading I'm going to go to remove over here on the left subheading click the little gears and go remove and now we have just got the shape um, but hey, look, you cannot see anything. What's going on um, when we play? Ah, what's going on? We can't see anything. This is because the shape is actually part of the video. And if I move here, if I move the X and Y here, I'm going to move the X first. And there we go. Now you're beginning to see what's going on. So now let me turn up the opacity to 100%. Aha. Uh -huh. Now we see what's going on. Now if we hit play, so you can see how it's kind of like cut a little segment. Let's just go back to uh, the beginning there. Uh, you can see how it's just cut a little segment out of his um, out of his legs there. Okay. So in fact, I'm going to just reset that. I'm going to reset that, and I'm just going to go over to edit. And uh, if you've seen the video on um, changing the speed, you will know that to change speed, we go to speed. Um, and I want to make it twice as long. So I'm actually going to go 50% of the speed and resize, do it. There we go. So we've just got a bit more to work with. Now let's go back over to our VFX because it was quite a short clip and... Uh, you know, I'd quite like to be able to just leave it playing for a while. Okay, so um, we can see now that if I move up and down, left and right, we've got our cutout segment. If 
I, I can stretch that as well, just as before, stretch that. And I can also move the location. I'm just going to reset these by clicking on these little, I'll zoom in so you can see these, these little white um, marks. Okay, so I'm going to go to crop. So it naturally, as you can see, let me just put that back. It naturally goes down to this bottom third of the screen. If I just put that back there, X, boom, naturally goes down to this bottom crop. So if I just move this and I go to crop, now we can see. So if I didn't want that last, if I didn't want that bit on the right, if I wanted to still see his uh, actual legs, I could do something like that. And, you know, we can see that. Okay, or maybe I didn't want his legs, it naturally defaults to this bottom third. So now we just mess around with the top. So we pull that. Okay, and so now we've got a mirror image here, hence the title of the video. And I'll hit play here. Yeah, so we've got a mirror image there. Um, but you know, you, you, you choose to do this how you want. I quite like it kind of focused in, in focused in on his midriff. Yeah. And maybe I'd want a bit more of that. So let's go, no, not left, we want right. There we go. And this is what I love about this. You can actually do it as the video is playing, which is a nice touch. Okay. So, this is a lovely little effect. I absolutely love this effect. Um, as well as uh, using one, you can put as many as you like. So even though, let me just put that back to the beginning. Uh, and then I'll go add. It's in my favorites now, so I'm not gonna scroll down to text. 50% uh, 50 cent, 50 center box. Get rid of the writing the headings and then we've got again we've got in fact let's shut this so that we don't get in fact let's get rid of this remove oops remove okay so now we've got two so let me just put that up to 100% um, open up the crop Um, so yeah, bottom there, so hit play, let's go forwards a little bit, there we go, he's starting to box. So yeah, I like, I like these a lot, you know, and you can play around with keyframes, obviously, maybe you'd want something uh, like, uh, let's play around with the first one we put there. Maybe you would like something like, uh, no, it's the right hand side we want, isn't it? Yeah, so maybe you'd want something like, you know, that to happen, some kind of reveal to happen. So we'd go like that. I'm just gonna do this very roughly, very roughly. Uh, add a keyframe here. And then I'm going to go forwards, I don't know, to about there. I'm going to add a keyframe there. And then I'm going to draw that back to the left. And then let's have a look at that. Okay, that's just coming up now. There we go, that's coming out quite slowly. I actually wanted that to come out a bit quicker. But as you can see, you can keyframe all of these elements and really get something quite nice looking. So yeah, play around with that. Remember, just go to VFX, go to add 50% text uh, center box, which is down in the text effects. Where is it? There it is, 50% center get rid of the um, writing of the titles 
and then just simply play around play around with that and you'll have you know you'll have some nice effects to to wow some people with okay so yeah hope hope you liked that and i will see you next time crypto g out